in store for you this evening. Great to be Listen to the Annie Moon, which actually looks great. I'm loving the, um, yeah, the green really nice, side. It's a really nice kind of synth, it's unusual kind of motion based uh, passing travels through it. Loads of presets here, and you see on the screen here, it's going to give you these different paths through which the signal travels as it's processed. And you can actually draw like a modulation path that wow, the that's signal great. travels through. And then, you can put that onto sync. You have a rate control for that, so you can change the speed at mm. which. So you can start out with any. Oh, that's a very kind of sine wavy, yeah, so resonant it, kind of sound. Can we get any volume at all coming out of the machine? This? I'm hearing it on my headphone, but I'd like to be able to hear it on nothing else beyond the headphone. So yeah. if we slow that down a bit, though, you can see now if we bring up the orbit rate, you see they're kind of uh, circling yeah, yeah, yeah. around. So yeah, it's very kind of interesting visual representation of what the audio is doing. Yeah. It's pretty cool, I think. As in, do you think you could write a piece of music by purely designing it and making a beautiful image? No. No, it's still all about the sound. Yeah. You don't think, think the interface will become kind of more important? In the right hands, this is a very useful creative tool. In the wrong hands, it's a force for evil. Yeah. <laughs> As my ears will, will attest to yeah. various points Sorry. of experiment. No, 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 it's all in the name of experimentation. <laughs> One of the really nice things about Mu is uh, in, in live you have lots of different devices. So here on this track I have something called the auto filter. If I tap on here, I can go to this device selector and open the device browser, and here I can see all my different devices. I'm not sure if you can read that too well there, but here is the auto filter. And now I have my own special controller just for the auto filter. So this is controlling the frequency, the panning rate, but the great thing about Mu is basically you've got a completely different controller for 